Hello and welcome to my website. My name is Benjamin Stewart at BenjaminLStewart.net. In this short video, I want to talk about my website, how you can go about navigating around the different pages, what it looks like on a desktop computer versus what it looks like on a cell phone. So here you see that in the desktop version, if you're accessing this from your uh, desktop computer, the website is divided into three columns. On the left-hand column at the very top, you have my name, which also serves as a link back to the home page. A toggle switch between dark mode and light mode, search option, and then also a list of all of the pages currently being published. In the middle column, you'll have the course content itself in this home page. I have um, a link to more information about the site. I have current courses that I'm teaching and I have information about my podcast and newsletter. And at the very bottom of each page, you're, you're likely to find links from external or outside links or pages in my website that link back to the page that you happen to be on. So for example, if I go into the thesis seminar homepage and scroll down towards the bottom, you'll see the list of other pages that link back to this page. So this is a good way to navigate around, depending on what you're looking for, to find relevant information related to the page that you happen to be on. On the right-hand column at the very top, you have an interactive graph that has two different views, a local view and a global view. The local view is a link of the nodes or the connected pages of the page that you happen to be on. So if we go back to the home page by clicking on here, my name, this will take you back to the home page, and you'll notice that these are the links to this home page. And if I click on this seminar, this is what it looks like. You can blow this up by clicking the up arrow and zoom in and out and scroll around as you need to. If you go back to the home page and select this icon, the global graph, then you have a link or a, a graph of the entire website. And again, you can zoom in and out scroll around and it just provides another way of visually accessing different connected pages throughout my website just below the interactive graph you have the table of contents so you have a heading called on this page and it's simply a way to scroll or jump around the page you're on depending on what kind of headings are being used to easily navigate around uh, the, the content without having to scroll up and down you can select these different headings and subheadings to find the information you're looking for. So this is what it looks like on a desktop computer. Let's see what it looks like on a cell phone. So as you see here, the default version is what we see in the middle column on the desktop version. We have here uh, the content information on the page itself. And if we scroll down at the bottom, we have the links to this page option. Of course, we have the outside links that go back or link back to the home page. If you click the hamburger menu at the top left-hand corner of your screen, we have the toggle back and forth between the dark mode and light mode, like what we saw in the left-hand column of the desktop view. And we have the search option along with the published pages as well. And we can scroll back here, go back to the home page. And essentially what we don't have is the, the right-hand column where we have the interactive graph and the table of contents that's not available in currently in the uh, version of uh, the mobile version uh, of viewing the website so let's go back to the desktop version okay so this has been just a very quick video giving you some tips on how you can navigate around the website if you have any suggestions or any feedback on the website itself feel free to reach out to me in my twitter handle at bnleez Again, I welcome you to my website.